Hey gamers, today I'm going to show you how to play PS2 games on your Android device using the PPSS22 emulator. Let's get started. Uh. Yeah. Uh. First you will need to install two APK from Google Play Store. First is PPSS22 emulator and second is Zarchiver. Simply search for PPSS22 is the search bar on Play Store. Click on the install button and wait for the installation to complete. Next search Z Archiver is search bar and install it. It is already installed in my phone. Now get some PS2 games to play. Quick note, download games legally. I have downloaded Dragon Ball Z for this video. Downloaded file is in .zip format by default, as you can see on the screen. We need to extract it first to get the .iso format file because PPSS22 runs only .iso files. So let's extract it. Open the Zarchiver app. Go to the file location where the download file is located. Now click on the .zip file and then click on extract here. It will take some time to extract depend on the size of .zip file. Let's increase the speed of the video to save time. Now the extraction is done. Now open File Manager app. We need to create a new folder in File Manager app where we are going to put the extracted.iso file. Create a new folder and name it PS2 Games. Let's move our .iso file in this folder. Follow the steps as showing on screen. I'm moving our extracted.iso game file into the newly created folder, which we have named PS2 Games, as you can see on screen. Here you can see that we have moved the game file successfully. Once you move the file, open the PPSS22 emulator. Now click on this button here. This pop-up will appear. We need to install the plugin for this emulator. Click here and it will directly take you to the Google Play Store. Install this plugin. Once install, go back to PPSS22 emulator and click here again to add games. You can see here the game file which we had moved earlier in this folder. If you can't see this folder directly, then find this folder manually and select the game as showing on screen. Make sure to turn off the internet if you wanted to avoid ad. However, it will be just a one-time ad. Our game has started running fine. You can change this screen layout from portrait to landscape by follow the same steps as showing on screen. You can also change the size of the screen by apply the same steps as showing on screen. You can start a new game or load an old one. Which will it be? If you encounter any issues during setup or gameplay, let me know in the comment section. That's it on today's tutorial on setting up PPSS22 emulator on your Android. If you have any questions or feedback, please leave them in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more gaming content and tutorials. And if you want the best settings for this emulator, watch this video. See you there.